guys, it's Shrimp Bob and welcome back to the video. I hope you guys are having the most spectacular day ever. And in today's video, we're going to be starting the decoration of our Bloxburg Hotel. It has honestly, guys, been so long since we've worked on the Bloxburg Hotel. So I'm so excited to continue today because of course I want to obviously finish it very soon. And today we're going to be starting the decoration of it, which makes us one step closer to the finishing of it. And I'm so excited. I also, guys, wanted to say thank you so much for 700 subscribers. We just hit 700 subscribers today, guys. So thank you so much, guys. Let me know what we should do for 700 subscribers. And guys, without a further ado, let's get started. Okay, guys, so we're about to get started in a second. Also, by the way, I think in the last video I made when we were doing this hotel, I mentioned I might add some stuff, which I did add a couple of things to the hotel because I really didn't know how to feel about it. And I still kind of am iffy about it, but I didn't really know what to add, though I wanted to add something. So I think I'm just going to add stuff if I see fit as we go along because I think that might be better if I see, like, specifically, like, oh, this definitely needs to be changed. So um, I guess we'll just see and wait to see what the outcome turns out for this hotel. I think for the flooring, I think we're going to do linen floorboards. I think that's gonna look good for this hotel. This isn't looking too bad so far. I think we can keep the linen floorboards. I think this might be a good look for our hotel. I'm also just realizing how long this is taking and how expensive this is gonna be, guys. Overall, I think this hotel is going to come out nice though, guys. I think this hotel has a lot of potential. Also, guys, um, right now I'm actually doing this in my Bloxburg neighborhood. So if you guys have Bloxburg and want to join my Bloxburg neighborhood, the code is TrimBeeWop. I'm on there all the time. We're always doing so many fun things on there, whether it's like build battles or like raiding houses and different things like that. So if you guys want to join my Bloxburg neighborhood, just insert the code TrimBeeWop and you guys can join on there. And I'm also on there all the time too. And I like to meet you guys. You guys are always on there, always like doing doing things on there so it was like just a lot of fun anyways guys we finished the flooring it's not looking bad I liked the look of it in the rooms I'm just not sure how I feel about it like everywhere but it's not bad guys I think this is looking pretty good so far I think we have something going on here the next thing we're going to be adding are some pillars because of course guys you need pillars in your build pillars just make your build 10 times better than they are what they already are so we're going to be adding some pillars to our hotel so far guys this is looking pretty good so far and i like how the touch of detail like even though we haven't added much these pillars have already done a lot for our build it just it's gonna look so um fancy and detailed once as we add all of these pillars which i'm just realizing how long this is gonna take because i have to put pillars in all the corners and we have quite a big hotel guys i'm not gonna lie so i'm gonna come back when we're probably about halfway done maybe i don't know yeah guys it's been like maybe five ten minutes and i'm still putting the pillars in and i'm still on the outside y'all so i'm gonna come back when i fully finish and we're gonna see how long it's gonna take yeah guys that took so long it took like 30 minutes to place all of those pillars there but we finally finished i had to get pillars everywhere it took forever but we finally finished and i love how this is turning out so far it looks a little bit better now a little bit better don't worry what guys it looks it does it looks okay right now but once we had an all the final details it's gonna look great now guys this is gonna take long too but we have to add wall trim so i'm not even gonna i'm gonna save y'all the time and all all the time and burden and i'm just gonna add all this wall trim and i'm gonna come back when every single bit of wall trims done that means like the top wall trim the bottom everything i'm gonna come back and we're gonna finally start actually putting decoration decorations okay y'all after finally so long i finally finished adding all of the pillars all the wall trim just look how much better it looks it looks like way better now that i've added all the pillars and stuff like not gonna lie it looks way better so now that we've finished all of that now it's finally oh wait i just i just realized i forgot to put pillar wall trim right here okay never mind guys we're not done yet now that we're actually finally done we can start on building the hotel we're gonna start with the entrance here i don't know what doors i'm gonna use i definitely think we're gonna go for a double door but i just don't know which one we should choose guys let me know which one you guys think i should choose for a double door or what door i should choose maybe like a revolving door or maybe like this kind i just i don't know i feel like i don't know yet i feel like until we know what we're gonna do i feel like we should just go on to the inside of the hotel and worry about this later 
Luckily, I do have a plan for what we're gonna do in the inside. So inside, right here, this is where the lobby is going to be. And then we're going to have a sign. And on the sign, it's gonna say like, oh, welcome to the hotel. And then it's gonna say like the prices of like the rooms and different things like that. So it's, we're gonna have like basic rooms, suites, different things like that. And it's gonna have all our information right here on the sign. So this is where people will come in. This is the first thing people are going to see. This is gonna be our little lobby area. And we're also gonna have a desk here too. I also don't know what desk I want to use. I think, I have a feeling, I feel like I'm going to probably make a custom advanced placement desk and not use any of these because I feel like none of these like really match what I'm going for. So I'm most likely going to end up making a custom desk. I'll let y'all know. Um, but for now, let's move on, right? I want over this, I want to put some lights. So I think we're going to put some lights over here. I'm also making this wall a brick color, but for the lights, I think we're gonna have some nice string lights because I want our hotel to be kind of cutesy a little bit. So I think we're gonna add some string lights. I don't know which ones we're gonna use. I think we might use spherical lights because those ones are very pretty. Yes, guys, this is already looking so nice. This looks so nice for our hotel. This is looking good, guys. This is looking really good. Guys, make sure you guys let me know what you guys think of the hotel. Let me know what you guys think we should add because I definitely appreciate all of the advice and all the things that you guys are saying too. And of course, guys, we have to have some good warm lighting. We're also gonna add a little bit of carpeting because I think this is gonna look very nice too. I just don't know what color we're gonna color it, but I think some nice carpeting here will be a nice touch for our hotel. This is a nice color, guys. I really like this area. This is actually looking very good. I'm so proud of myself. Uh, but now in these halls, we're going to have some lined carpeting some like on all of these hallways. I think that's gonna be nice to go over the flooring. And we're gonna use the resize tool and we're going to resize the carpet so it can fit the whole hallway. And we're gonna do that the same with this one, this one, the one next to it, and then we're gonna do it for the main hallway as well. See, so you guys get the gist. This is what we're gonna be doing to both of the sides. We have some nice carpeted flooring and then we're going to color it as well. I do not know what color to color this. I feel like uh, fog blue is a nice color. I like that color. I just don't know how it's gonna look for the whole hotel, but I think we can keep that for now. But fog blue is a good color, so we'll color that for now. It's looking nice. I kind of think it, it goes good with the brown flooring a little bit. Just a little bit, it looks kinda nice. And then over here, like I said before, I think in the confirmed floor plan video, I think I mentioned right here, we're going to have doors on both of these sides that lead out to the pool, because right in the center there, that's where the pool's gonna be. But I just, I also don't know what doors. I'm so lost on doors, because I want this to look good. I just don't know what I want. So I think for now, we're just gonna put door frames so I remember that the doors are supposed to go there, but I don't know what we're gonna do for that yet. I'll figure something out, guys, I promise. After this video, after this whole entire video, because we're not gonna finish decorating in this video, it's just a lot of things. We're gonna, afterwards, I'm going to create a video and I'm going to have finished this whole first story. I'm gonna show you guys all the confirmed details. And guys, we finished the carpeting, so this is what it'll look like. I know I feel about it like looking like this when it's going across. I might attach the carpet so it looks better, not the gap. But it, it doesn't look too bad, guys. It doesn't look too bad. We're definitely probably gonna switch that, but it's not looking too bad. And now we're going to add the doors on all of the rooms, which we have a lot of rooms so far. So I don't know how many floors we're actually gonna do. I feel like we're probably gonna do two or three, but we do have a lot of floors and we have a lot of rooms as well. So like each of these, have a room and a bathroom. These I think right here in the back, these are like our basic rooms. And in the front, the rooms that we have in the front are more of like our suites because they are way bigger and they're gonna have a lot more. Okay guys, so we have finished adding all the doors. We also finished today adding all the wall trim and the pillars which took so long and we added some decoration too. So we didn't make too much too much progress, but it wasn't that bad. Again, what took so long was the pillars and wall trim. It actually took forever because we have so many rooms and so many different things. Um, like I said again, next video, just so we can speed things up, I will be making a video where I tour the whole first story of the hotel because we do need to move along with this hotel and I'm going to be finishing everything up there and then we'll be starting the second story which I'm so excited about because I think this hotel is actually gonna turn out great and I think we're only gonna do like three or four stories of this hotel I'm not sure yet because we already have a lot of rooms but guys in a Bloxburg neighborhood you can fit about 50 people so we actually make a lot of rooms I can have all y'all join we could do a whole video on that which would be pretty cool 
But guys, I hope you did enjoy today's video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. And I hope you guys have the most spectacular day ever. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye.